good. Then nigga would It's not safe to move. Hang 
지금 가라고! soon. Oh, I can't believe my luck. You're safe now. Wait. My life, my lord. Go. Be well.
Master Nova. My lord, could I speak with you? The invaders are gone. It's not that, my lord. A group of bandits is terrorizing Komoda. They slaughtered my whole family like animals. Then I'll hunt them down like animals. Where do they kill your family? At our home, north of here, on the river. I'll pick up the bandits' trail there. What's your name? Saki, my lord. I will avenge your family, Saki. Do you know the tale of Tadayori, my lord? I know his name, but I've not heard of his exploits. It's long believed the Ama Tadayori war granted him great power, that it would be disastrous should it fall into the wrong hands. Then I can't let that happen. I'd like to hear more of this story, and this armor. The musician Yamato may be able to help. He told me the legend in Azamo, near the river that separates it from Sutsu. Let's go, Nova.
Must be sucky soul. Should check inside. Killed in cold blood. A map marking this location. What's it say? And then we can finally be together. This was no random attack. Nothing else here. I should check outside. Died trying to protect his family. What happened here? I heard the old Ketchi farm was freed. Thought I'd bring them horses and medicine. Bunch of bandits found me first. Took everything. Any idea where they were headed? They mentioned Komoda village. Whatever's left of it. I'll head there. Can you walk? Ketchi isn't far. I think so. Find those bastards. They thought this was funny.
Hindman, Archin. Believe. Thank you, Lord Sakai. Be careful up there. They say Hiyoshi Springs is a safer spot than the island. Somewhere safe. Be careful.
Sakai. You're safe now. Winter's too close. Ah! <laughs> 
Komoda village. The bandits could be here. Dogs killed Suki's family. It's what I thought. That would have been him. Enemy archer! Hear him around here. Where? You got help! Get down! Lord, will you let me go? If you tell me the truth, what were these men laughing at? Some poor girl. She was in love with Haruo. He was in charge. She told him where her family hid their rice. Was her name Saki? Yes, Saki. She thought Haruo would return her affection. Instead, he killed her family, took the rice, and left her in the ditch. And I was the instrument of her revenge. Get out of here! I'm going to have a word with Saki. Need a new quiver or satchel. An excellent choice. I'll see you again. May your hunt. Are you hunting for Shigenori's heavenly strike as well, my lord? Hmm. That technique is only one of myth. The musician Yamado insists the myth is real. I'm not surprised. People often speak of his stories with excitement. I heard the tale near Komatsu Forge. If it's as powerful as the story claims, let's hope you never face the technique in battle.
Would you like to see what I have? What's going on here? Lord Sakai, I think I saw Lady Masako riding for the beach at Komoda. Her husband died there, and her sons. I hear Mongols still hold the beach. I worry for her safety. I worry more for what she'll do to them. But you're right, I shouldn't leave her alone. It's a strange tragedy, my lord. Where is Saki? She drowned herself in the river. From what I understand, she blamed herself for the death of her family. She was manipulated by the bandits you met on the road. They won't do any more harm. Thank you, my lord. Perhaps some good will come of this. My lord, Straw Hat Ronin have been attacking travelers in Kubara. More of Yuzo's traitorous men, spilling innocent blood, working with the Mongols. I have family near the inn near Akashima Coast, my lord. I hope they're safe. I'll find the inn and deal with these traitors. Take me. Their bodies. Who killed these people? A fearsome warrior. He demanded I tell him the tale of Shigenori's heavenly strike. When he didn't hear the answers he sought, he flew into a rage and butchered them. What did he want to know? I am not sure, my lord. Tell me the story. I need to know what he's after. When Tsushima was first settled, a strange and terrible thunderstorm swept across our island. Wherever lightning struck, beasts of lightning appeared. These violent creatures tore through villages, causing death and destruction, moving too quickly to be stopped. The people knew only one man who could possibly stand against the lightning beasts, Shigenori. The fastest swordsman in all of Tsushima, Shigenori, never lost a duel. 
With years of practice, he had created the Heavenly Strike, an attack that struck quicker than the eye could follow. Shigenori lured the creatures to a desolate beach in Komatsu, where the sand would slow their movement. Their clash turned the sand to ash and bleached the leaves of trees white. Shigenori's heavenly strike cut through them faster than they could move. As the final beast fell, the storm cleared and Tsushima was safe again. Shigenori began a life of seclusion. Few students found him, and only the bravest and most skilled proved worthy of learning the heavenly strike. When a storm approaches, a sword is placed at Shigenori's rest by a student who knows of its location to ward off attacks from beasts of nature. The murderer wishes to learn Shigenori's heavenly strike. It sounds dangerous in the wrong hands. Which way did he go? A woman fled toward a nearby bridge. He chased her. He'll answer for what he did here. That's the bridge the musician mentioned. Someone weeping. Where? My lord, so many. He's slaughtered. Did you see the man who killed them? I know who he is. Yasuhira Koga. I've heard the name. He fought for the Yarikoa clan. Would you recognize him? I'll never forget that leering face. Follow me. Perhaps I can pick up his trail on the other side of the bridge. Horse tracks. Yasuhira was in a hurry. What more do you know of Yasuhira Koga? Only that he was a retainer for the Yarikawa clan years ago. After the rebellion was crushed, the clan was dissolved and retainers dismissed. Rumor says he left Tsushima, but when the Mongols attack, he returned. From where, I'm not sure. It doesn't matter. He cannot be allowed to live after what he's done. Anyway. We're pursuing a man named Yasuhira Koga. He just left. He's been staying in the watchtower. Working with the Mongols? Yes. But last night they argued. Only made out one word. Chigenori. I'll search the watchtower. Find somewhere safe before more Mongols come. What has Yasuhira been doing? Why 
white leaves, like those bleached by lightning in the tail. The Mongols have their own version of Shigenori's tale. Maybe he wanted to compare it to the musician's version. Dueling ring. He's looking for it. <laughs> Yasuhira is looking for someone who can teach him Shigenori's heavenly strike. The white leaves. There are trees like that not far from here. That's where he went. You've helped enough. Get to safety with the others. Thank you, my lord. I hope you punish that monster. Need to find white-leafed trees. Yasuhira must have gathered leaves from here. There it is. White leaves, like those bleached by lightning in the tail. Thank you. 
Someone's being tortured. was a man named Yasuhiro with these Mongols. Mm. He wanted to learn the heavenly strike from my grandfather and took him away. Your grandfather's in danger. Where did they go? His old training ground. A dueling ring on the Komatsu coast. Please, save him. So here I cannot learn the heavenly strike. Some cut that tree down in order to cross. <laughs> <laughs> 